not sure I'm going to be able to save my party. Everyone's coated in acid and very low on health. And splitting up, which is, you know, great. You know, guys, splitting up is about the worst thing you could be doing right now. Yeah, that's... That went about as well as I could have had it go, right up until the end. Whatever. I really, 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 really dislike this whole bit. I'm gonna leave and see if I can buy a bunch of curing spores and come back. This is obnoxious. Yay, three broad horizons! It's not lame. You know, on top of fighting a boss that you have to keep in melee because otherwise he'll completely annihilate you. Curing spores, curing spores, boy, oh boy, curing spores. Had I known the guy would be a Rot Horizon collector, I would have bought some before I get went there. Technically I won, but, you know, the morale system in this game can be kind of a pain in the butt, especially if you're trying to keep your creations alive and they decide, oh, let's split up and run in every direction except where we should actually go. So it's impossible to keep everyone healed. Good. You can buy and sell stuff I want. Exorbitant. Of course they are. What choice do I have? Guys, give me a break. Merchants that don't actually buy or sell anything. Natural goods, yes. Naturally grown steel broadsword. Crystals, blacksmith. Someone's gotta sell healing items in this town. Not those healing items. I mean healing items that are actually useful. Guess I could use that piece of bread as a sponge to wipe the acid off my body. Then I don't care. Hmm. Merchants are all worthless. I would like some curing spores, please. Because so far I haven't found anyone that's willing to train me in 
You know, the group. Please don't let me die of poison and acid damage spell. Although I don't think I have the skill to use that anyway. Augmentation would be spiffy, but nothing doing there. No one has it. It's probably only in canister form for a limited time only. See your reasonable prices. There better be curing spores involved. No, oh, you got essence pods. That's a start. Healing spores. I can sell some of this stuff anyway. those gems, and they barely cover the cost of the carrying spores that I, the only ones I found which were stupidly overpriced. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, let's see if three's enough. It's not. But hey, I'll have full essence, so there's that. I hope he's still there. If he is, I'll use my essence pods to boost the damage of my creations. If he isn't, I'll probably do that anyway, because I need some kind of edge. This is... obnoxious. Hundred and fifty, I can cast that boosting spell thrice. Of course he's gone. For you. Yeah, I figured that's what's was going to happen. So I've got one curing spore to work with. Yeah, 
I weakened him. Kill him now. Oh, yes, please summon your really lame rock horizons. Three of them. Not what I thought I was doing. Hey, I charmed him. And I charmed him. would do that. That's some good damage. I wonder what the access pass is for. That secret optional place, maybe? got poisoned, you did. Now he's on the other side. Kill him now. Geez, he had a second set of Rot Horizons.
Steel Charm. Neat. Pure steel boots. When was, wasn't I looking for a pair of pure steel boots? I think I was. Maybe it's to uh, open up some sort of secret passage up here. No, I bet it's for the secret dungeon. Affected Greaves. Uh, so it's not pure steel I was looking for. I was looking for shaped Greaves. Not pure steel boots. Oh well. They look like they sell. And hey, I can carry more thanks to this strength charm. Oh, while we're here, we might as well kill those other three Rotorizens. And I've got the, uh... Alright, now we can kill them. percent chance to charm. I just cured him! That didn't work. 